Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm back again with another video. This time, how to get the perfect fry or crunch on samosas. You could take samosas out of the freezer, put them in the microwave and defrost them. But in this video, I'm just placing them out on a plate and I'm just gonna leave them to thaw. I'm going to leave them to thaw while I go about and do other things in the house. Like I have a two year old toddler and so I'm going to take care of him, spend some time with him. I'm even going to use a few moments just to cut up some vegetables because I like to have mine with some vegetables. So I have a cucumber and a carrot here and I'm just going to thoroughly wash them. Once they're nice and clean, then I'm going to peel them and then cut them up. So they are nice and clean and cut up. So I'm going to, I cut the cucumber in coins and the carrots in julian. My samosas are not quite ready yet. They're still defrosting. So I'm just putting some oil in the pot and I'm going to leave it to heat up on a very low heat. Now once it's ready and you place the samosas, you'll see it starts to bubble. And once that bubble is coming up a lot, then you know it's the right temperature. And so I'm just going to place each one inside the oil. So I have six of them and I'm just going to place all six of them in this pot. Normally you could um, deep fry samosas. Or you could use less oil than I'm using here. Then you'll see the oil start to cool down. You see less bubbles. You know it's time to turn them over. So I'm just going to flip them over to the other side. So that side could get brown too. And we're trying to get a nice even and color and I'm just going to do this until all the sides are cooked nicely so if you haven't already you can please subscribe to my channel or if you like the video then you can go ahead and give me a thumbs up I would really appreciate that okay so the samosas are nice and golden brown and I'm just gonna put them here it's nice and crisp and I'm going to, well, usually samosas are served with a chutney. And I have some chutney here that I've made. So you could listen for the crunch because I just want you to hear how it's supposed to sound. These samosas are so good. Thanks for watching and see you in my next video.